Hi guys, my name is Karina and welcome to Bookish Babbles. So, in today's episode, I'm going to be sharing you... What? So in today's episode... Episode? It's not a show, Karina. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my bookshelf. As you can see, it is very small. But Mika is forcing me to do this video, so... Here it is. So... Yeah, I don't think there's anything else left to say. Let's get right to it. So first, I wanted to start over here. This is just the top of my bookshelf where I keep some decorations. Here we have a little birthday pin that my boyfriend got me at Disney. And this is just one that I got for myself. Okay, so on top of here, I keep pictures of my loved ones. We have over there a picture of my boyfriend and my sister, my godmother and me, my godmother, my mom, and my sister when we were babies. I got another picture with my other godmother. I have a album from two of my favorite singers. We have Adele and Harry Styles. And over here, we have more pictures. Um, and then we have some decorations over here. In this one, I keep a bunch of my electronics and my universal pass and all that stuff. In the second one, I actually keep a lot of my pins. These are a lot of like my magnetic pins and a little bit of paper in there because I wanted to do like, you know, those TBRs in a jar. Uh, but yeah, we have a bunch of pins. We have a little Hufflepuff pin over here and a little pin with my initial on it. We also have this little teddy bear that my friend got me when she went to London. I want to go there one day. And we also have this little um, purse from Scotland that I'm thinking of putting my actual coins that I keep in that little um, plate there. I'm going to put it here. But um, I love Scotland and she brought me this. I want to go there one day. That's it. I also have a little journal over there and my Polaroid album right there. Over here on this side we have a little... Um, passage Proverbs 3 5 and then we have my graduation tassel over here it says 2018 I graduated this year then we have if it can focus a Marjorie Stoneman Douglas little thing for your tassels that they let us put on them over here we have this little plant that is supposed to be real but I don't really know because I never water it and we have a little Mockingjay pin just to get it out of the way over here, we have a little hamper box, and here I have my sketchbook, my iPad, which I read most of my comics on, and a lot of my Kindles. Um, it has magnetic stuff, so my pen's attached to it all the time. But I also have my yearbook here. And also down here, I keep some magazines and the one movie that I own, which is Pride and Prejudice and Zombies. Okay. Now let's get into the actual bookshelf. Over here is my TBR bookshelf. Um, here I have a lot of the books that I've recently gotten and books that my sister got me and all that stuff and books that I just generally want to read in the future. We have Ash Princess that I'm going to be reading with Mika next month. I found this book at Goodwill and I eventually want to read Harry Potter so I got the Chamber of Secrets. I also have this little thing here that says life supports me. In the back it says life created me to be fulfilled. I trust life and life is always there at every turn. I am safe. Okay. I'm just gonna have to hold the camera for this part because my tripod doesn't go far down enough. But over here we have a, um, a variety of different uh, organization features. Also in this one I organize it by size. So here we have my taller hardbacks and it merges down to the short paperbacks. But as I said, down here we have my Red Queen, a Star Touch Queen, which these two will eventually go down. But here I try to keep most of my series and series that I really enjoyed. So we have a Court of Thorns and Roses series. I know this is gonna bug you. <laughs> My sister got this for me. And in the US, when it came out, you could not find the paperback for this book anywhere. So she got that one. We have We Are the Ants, which I have to return. Also I have a random Bible here. 
and I also over here have series that I've started have not finished but I know I will love so we have Frostfire and Unkindness of Magicians is a standalone but I really liked it so it it is here so basically I guess this shelf is books that I liked except these two um, but yeah we have um, a Dark Shade of Magic series, we have Passenger, and over here we have my bookmarks. I have a little Iron Man um, pen. We have Magnus Chase, bookmarks that I've made. Um, Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them bookmarks. And then we have my Vampire Academy um, series, which I need the third one. The fact that I don't have the third one annoys me because it's just my favorite book. And then if we move down one shelf over here we have this eventually is going to be the shelf of books that I don't really enjoy that much uh, which is why this one will eventually go down but here I'm going to change this for books that I like but for now this is here just because it doesn't fit at this moment but we have Winter Song which is a book that I didn't like we have two notebooks over here and these two I like them but I haven't started them. This, them being here does not mean that I don't like them. Uh, this is um, The Greatest Adventures of Sherlock Holmes and the Iliad and the Odyssey by Homer. We have my DS here. It's very old. Um, we have The Fellowship of the Ring. This eventually will go in the shelf of books that I do like. Um, and then we have this random copy of Harry Potter which I honestly don't know how it got here. I, again, I've never read Harry Potter, but it's a paperback and it's very thick and it's been read. So I honestly don't know how it got here, but it, it's here. As we keep moving over here, we have my school books. So we have The Last Lecture, The Great Gatsby, uh, Vaclav and Lena, and then we have The Boy in the Striped Pajamas. Then we have Poison and another Bible. And again, this series will eventually go up here, uh, but I don't have enough space for the stuff that I do like at this point. Um, but this is the Hush Hush series, another Bible, and this does belong here because I didn't like that one. But yeah, that's pretty much it for my bookshelf. That's not all. I have now to move on to my nightstand. <laughs> So over here is my nightstand, which you guys see in most of my videos. This over here is my planner. This is my immediate TBR. So this is either books that I've just finished reading and I want to get a review done for them, or I plan on reading like these two, or I've already started reading. Now the other stack on this side is books that I recently purchased. I'm trying to get them all together and keep them together so I remember to do a haul. And then we have on top of those books I like to keep some little page flags so I can annotate when I'm in bed. And here, if I zoom out, we have this board which my mom got for me in my 16th birthday. Uh, we have a pictures with my mom and my best friend from Puerto Rico. We have a letter that I wrote senior year. We have my beautiful, handsome, most amazing boyfriend. We have my sister, college, this little necklace that my boyfriend got for me for my birthday. Really pretty. And we have a candle and my junior prom pictures, my friends. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, and I have a little nightlight over here and Alexa and a charger and these pretty pretty butterflies so yeah this is isn't she heard me thanks for the feedback cool so this isn't part of my bookshelf but I also keep my books here so I just wanted to show you guys this part so yeah that is all for today's video if you guys enjoyed this bookshelf tour please let me know down below I was a little hesitant on recording this just because my bookshelf is very small and I know that I love seeing uh, bookshelf tours because they're so huge and I want to know the books that people actually own. Um, so if you did enjoy it, please let me know. I would really enjoy feedback from you guys. Like I say in most videos, if you guys do the same video as me or a similar video where you just show your books, 
please let me know in the comments. I genuinely enjoy watching other people's content and I really want to interact with you guys. So if you do record this video or if you already have, let me know in the comments so I can check out your video. So yeah guys, that is all for today. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give this video a like and comment down below. If you would like to be my friend, all of my social links are down below in the description. And yeah, I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye guys.